would imagine. It's always been a dream come true. I, mean, I have a long year so far, and going into national championship, I really wanted to get it this year, but ended up getting run out, which wasn't too bad for me. I was still happy with my time and how I did and things. And coming out here, winning national champ, even bigger than uh, collegiate athletes. I mean, that's feel really great. Right? You, 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 you battled injuries indoors. Can you talk about what it was like coming back through the outdoor season to get to where you are now? Um, it was really tough. I mean, I really got down on myself. I didn't know how long it was going to take for me to actually get back into my rhythm and things, being strong, being able to get out there and compete with the rest of the guys. Um, but I ended up putting out real good. I mean, I worked with my coaching staff and my, my trainers and stuff, and they got me healthy real fast now because they would come out. Uh, today, I mean, basically, I just wanted to do the same thing I've been doing for the last two days. Uh, I didn't want to change too much anything. I wanted to stay relaxed, uh, keep my mindset right, not get too nervous, and run the race as smart as I could, and that's all I did yesterday. Tony, you talked in the past about you know, working with Coach Howard, relax, and, and not get so stressed out about the races. Did you guys do anything special this weekend? Um, this weekend, he just told me to go out and just keep doing what I've been doing all year. I mean, because before I used to come out, I used to get a little nervous, used to get my feet too out, too far in front of me, so i just been working on keeping them under me, and that's what he's been coaching me on. Do you that's do any been. specific exercises to, to do that? Um, not really, just basically high knees and um, A runs, keeping my feet right up underneath me. At this point in your career, could you imagine beating Jeremy Warner for the U.S. title? Oh, no, I mean, never, never, I would have never dreamed of doing this, I mean. I'm really blessed today. I think I really did this one day, coming out racing a guy like Jeremy Warner. I mean, that's been my biggest role model since I started running track and field, and coming out being able to beat him feels really great. How is it good having Calvin Smith as a teammate and now running against him? It feels really great. I mean, when I first came in, Calvin was a big role model for me. He, uh, he, he, he uh, Each day in practice, he pushed me. He told me I had to work hard if I wanted to be the best. And, Every day, that's all I kept seeing him doing, and to see him leave off and go pro, and I just wanted him to like, come out and be it. It's not better, it's great as him. Are you going to compete at a world championship? Yeah, I'm going to compete at a world championship. I'm going to go out. Hopefully, I get a win there, too. I mean, that would be really great for me.